Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to scale a picture and not lose any form of quality from the picture. So the first thing we're going to do is to open the picture that we're going to be using. So I downloaded this picture. So I'm just going to go to where the picture is and then I'm going to open it up. Right. So I'm going to open this picture up and as you can see this is the picture we are going to be using and you can see how clear it is so what i want to do now is to duplicate this image by hitting on ctrl j on my keyboard so by hitting on ctrl j on my keyboard i duplicate this image so i duplicate this image so i'm just going to delete this one and then i'm going to turn off this background and if i want to scale this down normally i'm going to do this I've scaled it down and um, if for any reason I want to scale it up again I'm going to scale it up again by hitting ctrl T and there you can see the quality of this picture right you can see the quality of this picture and how it is right now you can see that everything is being boxed into pixels and it's not clear at all so you can see how this picture is you can see how this picture is and it has lost the form of quality look at the previous look at the after after we um this is the picture after we um reduced it let me take it back to how it was before now so this is what we had and i reduced it because sometimes you might want to reduce the picture size and then you increase it again and this is what we have so yeah, you can see how it is. You can see how it is right now, which is very bad for the, any project that I want to use. It is very bad for our image to be like this. Do you understand? So I'm going to save this. And we can see how bad it is. Now, if you want to fix this, I'm just going to delete this image. So I'm going to drag this here and i'm going to delete it so if you want to fix this let's duplicate the layer again and then what we have to do is to convert to a smart object so i'm going to go to this side and i'm going to look for convert to smart object and this is it here convert to smart object so we're going to tap on convert to smart object and then i will hit ctrl t on my keyboard again and i'm going to reduce it I'm going to reduce the size let me turn off the background and Look at i'm zooming in and it's clear and let's zoom out again to how it was originally and you can see that the picture is still clear and it hasn't lost any detail whatsoever likewise if you change this back to a raster image and you do the same thing we did it's going to lose quality so one thing you should know that for you not to lose any quality on your image you have to convert to a smart object your layer has to have this sign first of all your layer has to have this sign first of all before you know that uh it's a smart object and it cannot lose quality so that'll be all for this video if you like this video kindly share this video and like this video also and most especially subscribe to this video so that youtube is going to recommend it to other people and they can learn from it as well so i'm going to see you in the next video until then peace out